Now we're going to look at how we can use column subtraction to subtract a larger number from a smaller number where we might need to do some exchanging. So as with column addition, we need to line both of our numbers up to begin with so that they're in the correct place value columns. So I always start in subtraction with my bigger number, which in this case is 31,056. And I'm going to take away 2,128. And I've made sure here that my units, tens, hundreds, thousands are lined up. Here we have a 10,000 amount in 31,056, but we don't have a 10,000 amount here. I'm now going to subtract each column, and when I'm subtracting, I always start with the lowest value column. So to begin with, I'm going to try and do 6 minus 8. Now because this number is smaller, 6 subtract 8 would give me a minus answer, which will not work in column subtraction. So what we need to do, we always need to try and make sure that this number on top is bigger than this number on the bottom. So we are going to go over here and we're going to exchange, we're going to borrow from this column. So this 5, we're going to take 1 from, which will make that 4, and we're going to put the 1 that we've just exchanged there. So now we're going to do 16 take away 8, which will give us 8. We can do that subtraction now because this number on top is bigger. We then go on to the next column, and we're going to do 4 subtract 2, which gives us 2. In this column, we need to do 0 subtract 1. But again, because this number is smaller than the bottom number, we're going to have to go to the next place value column and exchange 1. So we're getting rid of that and putting the 1 there. So we've now got 10, subtract 1, which gives us 9. I'm going to put my comma in to show that we're now into thousands. 0, take away 2, again we can't do because the bigger number is not on top. So we need to borrow from this 3. We're going to make that 2 because we've taken 1 away. And we're going to put the 1 that we've exchanged there. So we're now going to do 10, subtract 2, which equals 8. And 2, subtract nothing there, will leave us with 2. So 31,056 subtracts 2,128 gives us 28,928.